I'm CJ Ward. We begin tonight with a shortage of sheriff's deputies in Santa Barbara County and what it means for you and your family. News Channel 3's Vicki Nguyen joins us live from Santa Barbara with the story. And Vicki, you found out deputies may not arrive fast enough during the next emergency. CJ, according to the Human Resources Bureau, the Sheriff's Department is down 20 deputy sheriffs and 16 custody sh deputies. And what this means for people is it'll affect their response times dramatically. Morale is low within the Santa Barbara County Sheriff's Office. Higher-ups are trying to work around the shortage by asking deputies to work overtime. Because they're working so much overtime, which can cause problems on the job and off the job. The agency is down 8% of sheriff's deputies and 9% of custody deputies. Those numbers are expected to increase as more people retire or transfer to other agencies. We can't retain the current employees that we have. So we have veterans with over 10 years of service that just financially can't stay at this agency. Sheriff's deputies aren't under contract. Sergeant Welch says their pay and benefits package aren't competitive. The last time they received a raise was in 2011. So without an attractive benefits package, we can't recruit new employees. So what you're seeing is you're seeing the vacancies numbers increase and we can't hire uh, to replenish those vacancies. Deputies try to not use force, but it's a concern that could arise if deputies don't have the backup they need. We all love this county who work here. We just want them to receive the service that they're entitled to, which um, is, is excellent. Um, but unfortunately, we are not going to be able to continue to do that. Uh, if we're so short. Sheriff Bill Brown says he will ask the Board of Supervisors for additional staffing on Monday. And property. Almost. Sheriff Bill Brown says he'll continue to ask for more resources for the department like he has been for the past several years. Live in Santa Barbara, Vic Nguyen, News Channel.